Hey we what's up? In this episode I'm gonna show you how to create a Hibernate icon on your desktop. Besides that I will show you how to create a shortcut for hibernating your computer in order to increase your workflow and stop all of that boring stuff go to the start menu and click here from here on the hibernate. So stick around. Now for creating a shortcut, just right click on your desktop, go to the new, select the shortcut. So here in this part just write run dll32.exe powerprof.dll and don't worry about it, I will put this codes in the description so you can easily get them. Set suspend state 0 comma 1 comma 0 now click on next name this shortcut hibernate click on finish and there you go you have created a hibernate shortcut so now you can see the icon is not looking very good so for changing the icon just go to the properties click on change icon at this part, just look up for the windows icons. I will write the path and I will put this path in the description so you can easily get this also. So here system root backward slash system32 backward slash shell32 dot dll. Now click on this white space, you will get all of the windows icons. I like this icon so I am going to click on this icon, click on ok, apply. And OK. There you go. So now whenever I double click on this, my computer will go on hibernation. But now I'm going to create a shortcut for this. And for creating shortcut, just go to right click again, properties, and directly we are in the shortcut. Click on the shortcut key. Here you have to press any key that will be the shortcut for this hibernation icon. For example, I type H. Now the control alt plus H is the shortcut for the hibernation in our computer. Just apply it and OK it. Now there you go, congratulations. You have successfully created a hibernate button and also you have created a shortcut for that. And now you can easily put this here in your taskbar as well. And delete it from this place because we don't need it anymore. We have here and also we have a shortcut for this hibernate. So that's it guys, hope you enjoy, see you in the next lesson.